Greetings, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Edward. Yeah, I'm Derek. And we're back with Undertale, and I get to do it for a second. Hi. What do I click to continue? It's just Z. your disk drive popped out. Z. Seems as if everyone is perfectly happy. I want to turn down again. Monsters have returned to the surface. Peace and prosperity will rule across the land. Take a deep breath. There's nothing left to worry about. Mm. Well, there is one thing. One last threat. One being with the power to erase everything. Everything everyone's worked so hard for. By everyone, they mean you just randomly interacting with them. You know who I'm talking about, don't you? That's right. I'm talking about you. You still have the power to reset everything. Toriel, Sans, Asgore, Alphys, the Pirates, Undying. If you so choose, everyone will be ripped from this timeline and sent back before all this ever happened. No one, buddy, will remember anything. You'll be able to do whatever you want. Uh, that power. I know that power. That's the power you were fighting to stop, wasn't it? The power that I wanted to use. But now, the idea of resetting everything. I... I don't think I could do it all again. Not after that. Mm. So please, just let them go. Let Frisk be happy. Let Frisk live their life. But, if I can't change your mind, if you do end up erasing everything, you have to erase my memories, too. I'm sorry. You've probably heard this a hundred times already, haven't you? Well, that's all. See you later, Swift. Time to be super fucking depressing! That's a great way to start the freaking part, isn't it? To me, it's just kind of. True reset. Name the fall. It's such a true reset, you even reset your fucking name. Are you gonna be all cap heat crew? So it's, uh. Oh, wait, more important shit came up. My phone. Fuck the world. Fuck all of you. <laughs> yeah. Ikaru. So now everything's fully reset. No one remembers a thing. They're monsters. Ikaru. This way. Oh, look. Howdy! I'm Flowey. Flowey the flower. Hmm. You're new to the underground, aren't you? Carly, you must be so confused. Someone ought to teach you how things work around here. I guess little old me will have to do. Ready? Here we go. See that heart? That is your soul. The very combination of your being. Your soul starts out weak, but you can grow strong if you have lots of level. LV. What's LV stand for? Why, love, of course. You want some love, don't you? Don't worry, I'll share some with you. Down here, love is shared through... Little white friendliness pellets. Are you ready? Move around, get as many as you can. Hey, buddy, you missed them. Let's try again, okay? Is this a joke? Are you brain dead? Run into the bullets! Run this bullet. <laughs> you know what will, what's going on here. You just wanted to see me suffer. 
Oh, fuck. Die. Well. What? Oh. Fuck you. Poor old goat mom. What a terrible creature torturing such a poor, innocent youth. Ah, do not be afraid, my child. I am Toriel, caretaker of the ruins. I passed through this place every day to see if someone was going down. You are the first human to come here in a long time. Come, I will guide you through the catacombs. I don't think I should say any more of this because I've already had to voice um, all of it before in the past playthrough. Maybe. Up until point things that are just specific. goes back to the first voice and steals the scent. <laughs> goes back to the old part, fucking. Exact copy. So, are you gonna do this as you're as killing monsters on your way, and then if you reach the end of the area, killing them all right then, or are you just gonna run in circles at the beginning of the area and murder everything? I don't know. I'm just gonna do shit. Inevitably killing everything. Essentially, as you know, the only requirement to this run is killing everything. Hey, uh, hey, goat mom. Hey, goat mom. Goat mom. Goat mom. mom. You forgot some buttons. <laughs> You've seen me play Undertale, now you get to see Nate play Undertale. And this is how I originally played it. There's nothing different about how I originally played this to now. <laughs> well, it's the genocide run. Wait, there's no there's no goat mom blocking my way here. I should be able to walk goat past. Goatmom's soul blocks that. <laughs> there's no other button back here. It's time to... Press Z to read signs. Cool. I guess I don't have to go over to that thing back there. All right. What do I do? There's the there's the button over there. I want to go press that. I want to go. I want to go press that. <laughs> this one, right? Is there a hidden switch? Is this grass what it's supposed to tell me? Because I mean, there's grass over here. I don't know. Okay, cool, bye. I could entirely not kill this thing and it wouldn't count. Mm -hmm. The zombie is the only thing in the game that doesn't count. The first real test of what the fuck's gonna happen in the game is with that first frog that you run into. Dummies are not for fighting, they're for talking. <laughs> uh. Oh look! A frog it. Oh look! It's dead. Just casually looks on as you murder that frog. Um, <laughs> goes to continue walking to distance. The literal hand holding. Literal, completely literal. Can we go back that No. Oh, that would be fucking funny. Alice is forgiven. Walks away. Fuck this. Oh. If there's anything good mom taught me to do, it's to stay on the path. I feel like every time I talk about this, I fucking need to. Just makes me hate those ones that are like, just barely. Wide enough for you to go up and down, so you're perfect. Damn it. My feet went off the path. I'm sure my head probably did a couple times, too. I was merely behind this pillar at the end of the room the whole time. Death drop independence. It's 
it's dangerous to go that way. Take this. I will give you this cell phone. It is made from amoebas. <laughs> oh, oh God! <laughs> You've not left the room, have you? Of course not. Just take one. Take piece candy. Ooh, piece, piece candy. candy. Take one. Take candy. You took more candy. How disgusting. Take one. Take candy. You take another piece. You feel like a scum of the earth. Take one. Take candy. You took too much too fast. Candy spills onto the floor. We're all fucked. Can I take the floor candy? I'll get what you've done. But I can't. I have no qualms of floor candy. <laughs> floor candy. I mean, it's all wrapped anyway. There we go. Oh! Oh, gonna murder another one. Oh, it's not wrecked. I missed my perfect fit. Meow. That's Todd, by the way. He fucking, like, weaved in between the flies. Dead. Oh, oh, oh I'm dead. So, Undertale turned into a completely different game when you decide to go the genocide run. Turns into this playful, happy, cheerful adventure to a very dark and depressing one. And that's the kind of adventure going on now. If you don't like that, you should probably leave now. I like bee scotch. All you bee scotch haters can suck one big fat one. Nathan, just realized something. Hmm? Um, considering the mic's right there and the... the, the the volume's actually somehow loud enough to reach the headphones. Um, is the mic gonna be picking up the volume again? I don't know. Then again, it's doing, it does that anyway, I suppose, so it doesn't really matter. It does it with the TV, I suppose, so it probably should super matter. Hopefully. Hopefully. I'm just more concerned Luckily, about my pie favoritism. Luckily, even if it does fuck up, it's we're probably only gonna be going through the ruins this play too, so, or this, this bit, so... Even if it does actually fuck up, it won't be that bad. No reason, no reason at all. No, totally not suspicious, goat mom. Yeah, I did just fall through, right? Uh, yeah, you just fall through the floor. And read the answer. <laughs> <laughs> uh, at least it's better than my solution. You know what I'm gonna do? What? I'm gonna keep doing it over and over again. Checking each and every individual spot where I know these are. And I'm gonna leave my face in the game. I don't know if that would take fucking forever. You realize that, right? Oh, yeah, Jumbo's playing um, 14 now, by the way. That's cool. He's a uh, archivist. He's gonna be a scholar. Damn it. Too eager. His brothers have forgotten really things. Yeah. And he's got two friends that are uh, rivals. <laughs> he's wanting us to join him. Or yeah, maybe if our internet doesn't That's what I told him. First, I'd have, have to check that. And we'd have to do our characters again. Well, we could just make new bitches. Yeah, but I mean... Mold small and mold small. Mold small. I put my super, put super fucking far behind. Because he's already at like level 20. And his friends are like in the 50s. Kevin's... Yeah, I'm not going to move my character again. Well, I'm moving mine, so... Alright, cool. Be lame and stuff. I'm not gonna fucking. <laughs> I'm not redoing all that goddamn time. <laughs> cool, be lame and stuff. I'm not interested in doing that. Oh, it doesn't explode because he's alone. I won't even get back into the game if I had to move my fucking shit again. And no, it exploded when he was alone the one um, at first. Whoa, Ole! Oh, you got it? No. Oh, well, never mind. I was just doing because I thought it was funny. <laughs> move more, you fucking rat. Don't Wrong be, way, you fucking rack. Don't be rack stupid. What, you want me to stay there? Nah. Yes, you shit. Stay there. Don't fucking move. God, stupid rock. Eat your shit up. Kill it with the rest. Oh, look, it's an obstacle. Oh, 
to me, of course. It's up to you to speak then for Nopsa Blook. Here comes Nopsa Blook. Just plugging along. Oh shit, Nopsa Blook is here. Pissed. We danger. Whoa, you. <laughs> Damn it. Highway to the danger zone. I'm really not really up to it right now. Sorry. Oh. It'd be funny if those words hurt you. <laughs> oh god. Can I have a break time? I just I'm realized fine. that Thanks. Nobstabluke and uh, Venetone are the only two people with um, like break time moves. Well, you could say that one Spartan guy just does too. Just plugging along. I don't really care to. Let's go watch. Hardcore dodge on skills. Um, you do know that you can't kill ghosts, right? We're just sort of incorporeal and all. I was just lowering my health at HP because I didn't want to be rude. Sorry, I just made this more awkward. Pretend you beat me. Whoa. You won! You lost! One experience point. What the? Mm, kick some ease. It's this way. The actual way. Get that spider over there. The yeah, act spider stuff. Spider break stuff. All pursuits go with spiders. Kick some trees again. Mm -hmm. I need your fucking hero games. I got candy, motherfucker. Pieces of it. You think? Yes, Toriel. Uh huh. Yep. That's called throwing other stuff at Toriel. <laughs> yeah. uh, you're gonna get to the throw the other names out and it's just not even. Oh, oh my god. Oh, you're gonna have them do the pick dates? Oh. This crack here. Damn it. I have to fight Vegetoid. Oh, you're local. Very local, actually. He fucked you up. Yeah. Two hits. Much more taste. <laughs> Damn it. I got cross up there. Cross up combination. Fuck it. Yeah, frog is dead. Damn it. Kill me. Mm -hmm. This one? Damn. That one. Bottom left is items. Yeah. Damn. Nuke straws. Yeah. Oh, I don't need my Please stick. Please don't pick on me. Just because I'm an asshole. You smoke. Damn. Well, you need some candy after this. Oh, I'm not staring at that face. Damn. Mm. You can kill it. Yeah. And then just heal afterwards. Survives yeah. with one HP. The fuck were you saying? Oh, <laughs> oh I accessed my bag. See? No, no, no. You have not to get into attention. Oh, you only two of them? Yeah, even that still didn't full heal me. Yeah, I only took twice the two. You were actually leveling up in this round in this round. Well, you were leveling up, I I didn't. You have to the top one. Top middle. Top middle? Yeah. You gotta hit the switch so you stop to turn off the spikes. More important shit than you.
see him through all this bullshit. A pair of better towards came out of the ground. Right. Fresh what? morning wood, I mean taste. By the way. You just stood there. <laughs> yeah, I know, and I still took two hits, which is exactly what I always take. Well, you could try to dodge it. That just spawned on me. That was bullshit. <laughs> and I still took two hits. Actually, it spawned and fell on me. Well, yeah. Whoa, shit. You just Whoa, dodge shit. These attacks are standing at the bottom of the screen. Well, yeah, because they usually spawn in, like, above you at the top, but... Otherwise, you have to like try to dodge the rebound too. Essentially, you're trying to dodge twice as much shit. We got the green switch. Try that second hit. This one. <laughs> you said the second really I'm like, mm, the last one, right? Okay. Of course. Oh. Save and then beat the shit out of everything here. Oh, you didn't get to do it either. I did not. I think I didn't, you didn't bring the, the bandage. bondage, I mean bandage. <laughs> God damn it. That's gross. What's gross? That's a long Bandages are very restrictive, mind you. I should have not left you alone to get my phone stolen by a dog. And your ass kicked. I didn't get my ass kicked. Oh. Just beat on. Well, now it's time to Nothing backtrack and candy kill save. everything in the ruins. And since we've essentially seen every enemy formation except for two Lokses, are we skipping this? 